Hi friends, I am Dr. Kiran, orthopedic spine surgeon, rheumatology recent qualification and uh, this guy is Bablu. This guy is Bablu, he is an Australian terrier whom I took on adoption. He developed a complication from Arnofloxacin. In my view, uh, the veterinary doctor and the hospital, they refused to accept this. I don't mind. I don't mind but they unfortunately did not at least give me a submit a, a letter of inquiry a preliminary inquiry because the other pets could be involved similarly well anyway leaving all that I have to deal with this guy's problem because he's a very friendly hello he always wants to go out always wants to play and his eyes used to his he used to talk to me through his eyes these voiceless animals they are uh, dr. Doolittle's uh, pets <laughs> so once he got uh, blind how I realized was he was bumping into car tires and cars which were parked when I was taking him for a walk and he had a taxi also when he was peeing he couldn't st stand so then I realized oh okay then I searched for the medicines that were given it is uh, in cats it's established that arnofloxacin can cause permanent or temporary retinal blindness in dogs it is not documented so maybe that's why they couldn't accept it so no blames but be careful my friends whoever have pets if you are giving arnofloxacin it was an inpatient treatment they gave and i went to india i kept him there for unit tract infection so maybe i don't know i am not sure no, no document is given for the dosages and all that is given anyway my problem is i have to give him a visual aid visual aid okay i designed this don't mistake that it is a bose product the cover Okay, I am using the cover of Bose earbuds I have uh, used because it's spare with me. I cut it and made holes for the eyes of this gadget which was made by Parviz of Al Dafra Electronics in Abu Dhabi. Now, the genesis of this uh, beautiful uh, design I can say is when he was in this kind of a problem, predicament, I uh, was discussing with my friend from UDP. He's a master's in uh, computer sciences, Mr. Vinay. He told me, doctor, they are available online already. Their designs which have uh, which meet your standards. Like I said, I want a sonar sonar alert. When he goes near an object, you should say key, so he'll avoid it. It started there. Then he said, uh, preliminary, why don't you buy him a ring, ring around the head because the ring will be farther away. When he goes, the ring will hit the obstacle and he will stop. I said, that's cumbersome to make the ring stay parallel to the ground. He must be having big holdings and it's not convenient for a guy who wants freedom. He doesn't even let me put a, <laughs> a, a chain on his neck. So... Uh, then he said, okay, doctor, we will say, uh, find something else. Such a positive minded individual, Mr. Vinay of Udupi is. He sent me some already existent videos of such sonar alerts, which were being used for uh, visually challenged people. So now I'm in Abu Dhabi. Those videos are from India and other places. So I started uh, searching for um, electronic shops. Before that, I went for a spectacles shop. <laughs> I got him a spectacles. <laughs> <laughs> well, but it is not stable. It was falling off, bending off. And it is, uh, okay, from the side, still he can have a penetration injury. He doesn't suit. So I went for a search for goggles, swimming goggles. Then also, I somehow thought he won't keep it. He was doing like this. <laughs> and he tries to... <laughs> <laughs> throw throw the uh, specs off so then i went to one aldafra uh, electronic shop where five six people staff were uh, standing when i told him they told them the whole story they were in uh, uh, shock uh, what does this fellow who claims to be an orthopedic surgeon want they were not understanding the depth with which the quash my desire to get it done so finally, suddenly a face appeared from behind the computer. The young man of 28 years, maybe 30 years, 
also. I am Parvis, doctor. I can help you. One positive guy who, who was very keen. See, these are the guys uh, whom uh, we all must encourage. So he said, uh, yes, sir, I'll give you. And he showed me some videos. And he said, I'll design it for you. We talked about the amount. Because that was not the point. Money was not the point. It is not too costly. Like in Indian rupees, around 6,500 it costed me. Uh, somewhere like that. 6,000 to 7,000 in between. So I said, okay, it's worth it. Because his eyes are more important than 7,000 rupees of Indian rupees. So he designed. Then uh, I said, I don't want a sound. Because dogs are very sensitive to sound. Because a owner comes one street away. They stand up and wait for the uh, owner to come. So I didn't want to hurt his uh, ears. But then sometimes we can't help it. So he designed one uh, model. And then he put a, a battery, uh, so a watch battery and a buzzer like a, for a vibration mode. Then he said, doctor, this will consume too much. Uh, battery will go off very early. Why don't we go? Parviz, he, his suggestion was, why don't we go with a charger pin? I said, don't worry, go ahead. Then he put a C, C pin, okay? It is a C pin or inlet and it has a green and a blue, um, when it, blue, blue and red, when it is charging red and it becomes blue once it is charged. And he used a lithium battery. Here, this is the, I covered it up, lithium battery. So when it came, it came without a cover, it was bare. And then naturally the electronic circuits will break or bend and it will get, they, they, it's get lost for this one. So I cut all the sides and the surfaces I used to cover this and put a sellotape to protect the inner circuit. Then I was searching for something else. Suddenly in a grocery shop I found this nice beautiful uh, chain. It is correct. I thought wow, wow, just below my house I found it. It's correct to his neck. That's what I say. Sankalpam. If you are... Uh, uh, desire is to serve, God will show away. So I immediately bought this and then I was searching for something where I can hang it because it should be literally it will be like this but I, he, he won't keep it. He won't keep it on his forehead definitely so I have to be, better hang it. First I hanged it like this then his fur was coming in place so I decided to hang it like this. So then I found a Bose um, earbuds uh, case. So what I did was I just took it out and put this inside and then and it is on and off switch okay we charged it and this is how it is going to hang in his under under his neck i hope you uh, all of you got it so my friends if you want um, anybody if you have a pet and you have this problem my Email is teleconsult doctor, T E L E C O N S U L T, consult T R D R, okay, at the rate of gmail.com. Just pass me a mail. I'll try to help your pet in whatever way I can. Because how could I do it? Because I'm an innovator and uh, I'm a national award winner for uh, uh, all these kinds of uh, innovations and uh, serving the people with disabilities and um, deprived I have innovated I have made uh, some cal special calipers special wheelchairs till now and uh, yeah now I am uh, of the age ripe enough to finance myself and to do something for the society give back time it's uh, probably this is how the design of God and his fate my fate that we met together like this and today you are going to see the, the video how he walks through so thank you for your blessings and uh, um, any help from my side, please do uh, mail me. Go. Wall. What will you do? There's a wall. Turn back. That that pretty well demonstrates how beautiful this is working. And there's no sound now. So my friends, if you need more, if you have a pet dog or a cat or any other animal which is having these kind of problems, do consult me. You can consult me there and ask me, if you want to know more about this gadget which we designed with an already existent uh, prototype thank you